hello guys and welcome to another powerpoint tutorial in this video i'll show you how to create this impressive powerpoint animation so the first thing we're going to do is insert a rectangle on the slide duplicate the rectangle three times select all the rectangles and group them drag to fit the slide then ungroup the rectangles now let's format these rectangles by changing their colors you can do this manually However, I like to use a color theme when designing slides because it saves time when editing and reusing the slide as a template. So I'll select the custom color theme, then change the color of the rectangles. Once you're done, select all the rectangles and remove the outlines. Now let's insert text. I'll just paste my text from my clipboard. You can go ahead and insert a text box and align it with the first rectangle. As you can see, the font in use for this presentation is Georama. The link's in the description if you would like to download it. Also, the text box is left aligned with some indentation before the text and some spacing between the heading and body text. Let's also give the text some visual representation by inserting an icon. I'll insert my icon directly from PowerPoint's creative library. If you don't have access, you can always use external sources for your icons. Let's reduce the size, change the color, then align the icon with the text box. Group the icon and the text box. Now I'll duplicate the grouped object for the remaining rectangles. Edit the text. Then switch to different icons to visually represent the text. Duplicate the slide. On this slide, delete these objects and insert text into the rectangles. Then select all the rectangles and cut them. Delete the slide. Then paste the rectangles here and align them on the slide. With the rectangles selected, head to the Animations tab and select More Exit Effects. Then add Whip Out Animations to the rectangles. Open the Animation pane and start the Whip Out Animations on Click. Enter the Effect Options, then animate the text all at once. With the animation selected, add Fade In Animations. To be able to loop these animations continuously, we need to trigger them with the click of an object. So, let's insert a rectangle to cover the slide. I'll open the selection pane so we can see the name of the rectangle. Now, select all the animations and trigger them with the click of the rectangle. Now, let's make the rectangle invisible by increasing the transparency of the fill color and removing the outline. Alright, let's give it a preview on full screen. As you can see, with clicks, we get the whip out animations. If we click again, all the rectangles fade in, and with the help of animation triggers, we can loop these animations until the end of time. Now, if you want to use this slide as an editable template, open the selection pane and hide the invisible rectangles so you can edit the objects behind it. If you'd like to edit the text boxes and the vector graphics, simply hide these rectangles so you can see and edit them easily. Once you're done, unhide all the objects. There you go. That's how to create this impressive animation in PowerPoint. If you like the tutorial, please support the channel by liking this video. 
leaving a comment and subscribing for more PowerPoint awesomeness. Thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you guys on the next one.